Hello guys, um, this is Thomas Sunfield and, uh, and I'm going to play the... <laughs> Stop! <laughs> You're interrupting it. Planet Fall by Steve Moratsky. <laughs> One of my dad's friends. Also, before I start, here's a quick note. <laughs> <laughs> Lewis, leave him. Even, you see, there's a... Lewis, I'm going to beat you up. Get away from him. I may sound a bit squeaky, although I don't sound like that. I sound a bit more deeper. But with that done, let's just... I'll just... Play on. <laughs> yes. So you have to read out what's on the screen. So, deck map. This is a featureless corridor similar to every other corridor it's on the ship. It curves away to starboard, but... And the gangway leaves up to port is the entrance on one of the ship's primary escape pods. Oh, the pod bulkhead is closed. Also, port. Port? Um, port. Can okay, you remember what we said about port and starboard? Let's find out. Okay. One's left to right, and I can't remember which one is which. Starboard, the right side of the ship. Port is the left. Hello. Keep the colour scheme, but uh, don't show this message again. Okay, go. Okay, you can stop. Okay, so, so yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, <laughs> port. No, we can't go that way. Seriously, the port is one of the shit primary is. Gate pods. I know, but what does it say after that? Portable. Uh, the pod bulkhead's closed. <laughs> oh, Louis, get out of the way. Okay. You. You. Oh, in some blather. Um, deck A. There's a, there's a featureless corridor leaving port port and starboard. I mean, port and starboard. A gangway leads down, and the four is the hyper-special jump machine room. I think we um, should. Hey! I just had to tax something. Uh, ah, stop! No, no, no. Stop! No, no, no. Wait. Stop! Wait. stop. No. <laughs> right, Thomas, hold the laptop. <laughs> I'm going to get the Lewis. You can't, Lewis! <laughs> you're messing it up! Come on, Dad, Louis. keep Lewis down! Keep Lewis down! Keep Lewis down! Yes! Right, I'm going to play on this fine, Michael. Here I go. Meh. Oh, yes. Here is it there's the oh, main dude. drive area to stop or this the iron reactor that powers the vessel and after here is the exterior control the cold oil control in support and this again seriously e ah port so what should I do? Hmm. I think we have to wait a bit, don't we? Tight wait. Wait. Wait a minute, oh, one, two. Yeah. What does it say now? So the alien 
Amber Saw from Planet Blow Bibbon Gordo Ambles Toward You from Dan Carter. He's bun munching on something resembling of an, an enormous stalk of celery. He, and he leaves a trail of green slime on the deck. He's docked nearby and you wince as a pool of slime begins forming beneath him on your newly prized desk. The ambassador reads loudly and hands you a br brochure outlining his planet's major exports. Take. What do you want to take? Well, I think he's already handed it to you. Try typing I for inventory and see what you're carrying. You're carrying... A brochure? Uh, so you can type read brochure if you want. Let me just have a look how you're going. Read... Bro... Broker thingy magic. I don't know what you're okay. typing. Plant for... Win by... S. Eric Maraski. But I want to say, bear yet by a thousand. The ambassador asks where um, Admiral Smithers can be found. And never mind, port. So sweet. The ambassador. Okay. Ah, not that. You can re repeat your last command with X. Oh no, sorry, what am I about X? Wait. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> press up, press up to do your last command. Oh. There. Let's say. Okay, port. Port. Hooray, well done. Poor escape pod. The bulkhead. Okay, this is one of Frank Dyke's primary escape pods. In use for dream emergencies, a massive safety webbing large enough to hold several dozen people fills half the pod. The controls are entirely automated. The bulkhead lead now is open. Chip to get emergency bulkheads closing. I'm just going to put get in bulk head are you in? looks like it tight look escape pod what should I do now? still in it, uh, that's it the bulk head leading out is closed you feel the pod begin to slide down its ejection tube as explosions shake the mothership. Uh, tight weight. You just want it to move on to its next turn. I think you're in the air now. You are. What does it say? Where's the light dot sorts on here? Here's a space blows the fi fine sign in tiny pieces. Send the big escape pod tumbling away. You're thrown against the bulkhead, bruising a few limbs. The safety weapon may have offered a bit more protection. As the escape pod tumbles away from the former location of the Feinstein, its gyroscopes whine. The, the pod slowly stops tumbling. Lights on the control pad and all blink, blink furiously as the autopilot searches for a reasonable destination. Hang on a minute. Wait. And the auxiliary rockets fire briefly, and a nearby planet swings into view through the port. Appears to be almost entirely ocean, with just a few visible islands on unusually small polar ice cap. A moment later, the system sun swings into view. The viewport pol polarizes into a featureless black rectangle. The main thrust is by a long, gentle burst. A monotonic voice issues from the control panel. Approaching planet, planet, human habitable. So yeah, wait. Time passes. Nope. Have we landed yet? The pod <laughs> is buffeted as it enters the planet's uh, atmosphere.
Freeze the temperature against rice. And the pot's slime mate control system rules as it labors to compensate. Hey. The viewport suddenly becomes transparent again, giving you a beauty of endless ocean below. The lights on the control plan flash madly as the pod's computer searches for a suitable landing site. The thrusters fire long and hard, slowing the pod's decent descent. Time passes. The pod is now approaching the closer of a pair of islands. It appears to be surrounded by sheer cliffs rising from the water and is topped by a wide plateau. The plateau seems to be covered in by a sprawling complex of buildings. The pod, whose automated controls were unfortunately decided by cute fighters, lands with a good deal of fuss. Your body says the pod <laughs> until he's stopped by one of the oh, sharp man. corners of the control panel. <laughs> Seriously? Oh, man. <laughs> what happened there? What do you think we should have done? I don't... Um... Get out pod, but yeah, I'm just, but um, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> I'm not gonna play this game anymore. <laughs> this is too hard. <laughs>